So again, I'm in a walk stance, I'm using my body weight, and I'm going to press and move. Press and move. And you can actually do a little circle as well. So press and do a little release. Press, do a little release. Press. I'm just slightly left of Alison's head, so as I come forward, I'm not going to rest my boobs on her head, which is always a good thing. And I'm going to come right down, right down, coccyx. not quite coccyx, because coccyx is kind of underneath. Yeah. Yeah. And then I'm going to stretch all the way back again. And I'll probably only do that once because it's quite hard on your thumbs. But it's just, it's quite a nice movement. So you could do that. You could run. You can use your knuckles. My finger's still a bit poorly. But you could use your knuckles. But you have to be careful that you're not exerting too much pressure. And for a, a smaller client, that actually might be just too, much. too much. You can use your thumbs. I wouldn't recommend you use your elbows, that's way too much on the spinal area. Okay, you can be reinforced, you can do finger. But come as far down as you can. Does that feel alright, Annie? And then stretch. All the way back up again. To get to the top. 